Gets all aggressive and shout, Sleepy G, because he's addicted to his therapist couch. <laughs> and with that flow and accent, I can tell that you're a fraud inside. Thought you were from overseas. Because you've been abroad for time. <laughs> Walk up with a hand grenade and a blade sharper than the one the Tory hands on me. Pissed up, don't bother to frisk me. Unstable, handgun and bottle of whiskey. Roulette wheel spinning quickly and a girl over there who would probably kiss me. I feel good but sleazy again, like my girlfriend might not see me again. Summer's coming and I'm eager again. Tell a friend, tell a friend, there's no need to pretend. Uh, about as stable as a weak horse. This year's mine, how can it be yours? I'm in a tuk tuk on Peckham High Street with a basket full of stolen, low priced meat. Like, life's a game with no paradise, but it's okay when you live opposite paradise. Blood filled with them toxins. So often. What's going on? Don't flop all fucking day. You know the score. We're back here. It's Rapping It Park. We're at the Album Memorial. First Don't Flop official channel battle of the day. Everyone make some noise. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Shout out my boy K behind me. It ain't gay if you're the giver. Let's get into the number one battle of the day. MC on my right hand side just got to have a dope battle with Liv Winner. Make sure you watch it if you ain't seen it yet. My man Craft D, make some noise. Let's go. Yeah. On my left hand side, we've got a returning MC, be on the Don't Flop channel for years before, but now coming back in 2015, we got my man Press One. Make some noise. Yeah. Alright, yeah. right, we chose off camera, it's gonna be Press One. It's a three-round battle, first three-round battle, five judges as well. It's on my man Press. Let's go. Yeah. My big hungry return to battling. Boy, I feel stupid again. Because I haven't done this since Don't Flop gave out free food at events. <laughs> <laughs> haven't done this since I rolled with that degenerate gang. Had a fight during the battle, disrespected the brand. No show to a clash with Tony pending my ban. Raw for a battle like that now I'd have to send him a grand. <laughs> Beg him out of retirement like I was sending for grand. You haven't done this since you choked against that effeminate man. <laughs> See, I got a lot of history. You got two battles to go by, and a band camp site for the shit I won't go by. I battled Skinny Man, Verb T, and Kruger. So never forget that. This battle ain't a stepping stone, this battle's a step back. I thought it's alright. Then I realized how small of a threat you are when in every bar the heavy part is where the setup starts. Mm. That's not how you do it, dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> See, his repertoire's not very smart. A tourist in a messy part, a town he walks around and struggling for him to get the part. I'm a press one burner on the tracks, there's no way you can collect my art. Mm. Your Banksy on the wall is cool, but I do not respect the craft. Mm. Mm. Why do these pansy guys rap and this angry guy act them pussy out when their crotchless panty lines flashed? Mm. <laughs> MC anti-climax, I don't consider you a threat. <laughs> You're literally so dead, it's like you hit them with a combo then you kiss them at the end. <laughs> <laughs> versus, versus live winter, he said. Live winter will die in the spring. <laughs> That's not a good way to rhyme, but some are better and some is better. Today's a good day to die. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I know what you're all thinking. You look familiar. I'm trying to work it out in your heads. Maybe someone that you've seen hanging down in your ends. Maybe someone that you've seen hanging around at events. But that's press one. Last battle in June, 2010. <laughs> <laughs> Let me put it in perspective for those who are gassed. It means he hasn't had a battle since Tone was a champ. <laughs> Since Osh was oh, a champ, no. that means he hasn't had a battle since before my exams in year 10. <laughs> <laughs> See, most old school battlers return on the main stage with a claim to fame. You didn't even make it onto training days. See, evolution's for the fist. You ain't surviving in here, you're old news. They won't know you this time in a year. You want to relive those old days, but the climates have steered. It's ironic. We're seeing press play just to rewind his career, but you can't press rewind, because for press, it's time. I'm the refresh. I could beat press when I'm pressed for time. Only sound I want to hear from press is time. When I'm next in line, you're getting left behind, so don't front like you left for fame and calibre. You were a failing battler, a fading amateur. You saw the lunars and the gris and had to obey the challenger. Could have went on to perform in USA and Canada, but switched to music to find something safe. A manager, but really, you just realised you ain't a challenger. You realised you didn't have the frame and stamina, so you left the game to have a change of character like Jamie Carragher took a downhill slicing in the same parameter. You ain't my calibre, I'm great a rapper, you're the prey and massacre. That's just a natural order. Ask David Attenborough. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You got, you got an audience today, man. You ain't spitting in the booth. I could bring one line of schemes, or just kill him in a two. Looking like Olivia Giroud's been living in a zoo. <laughs> <laughs>
You left Berlin to pursue music, but there's no escape from the pain. Tried to capitalize and made a lower case for your name. Blood sucked the industry <laughs> for a taste of the fame. There's vampires back from the dead. Now I'm staking a claim. You're as plain as it gets. Don't flop, need some stronger flavors. It's not a close shave. I'm the simple solution like Occam's razor. Rappers like you mm. can't bar. So you come with a comet nature for being the bane of our lives. I'll rid this joker like Gotham Savior. So you're, mm. Mm. <laughs> so you're a knowledge gamer. Yo, so you're a knowledge gamer, but not a player. That makes you a commentator. I lead this Persian needing surgeons beeping in an oscillator, meaning if I hit press one, you'll be speaking to the operator first. Mm. Mm. Yes, let's go. Yes, first two battles, I focused on bars and let go of grasp and tempo. Today, I'm going for execution like a march from death row. Your freestyles are okay. You ain't disaster or Pedro, and you've been out for five years, so your bars are retro. Let me start with Presto. I'm starting Presto. That's a faster tempo with a marked Allegro. Why you par with next jokes that aren't direct quotes? I'll stick to the theme like a party dress code. So the next two rounds, watch me bar this vet home. Watch me bar this vet home. Carve his headstone, because I'm killing off press. That's Charlie Hebdo. Mm. Mm. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Press one, let's go, boy. Charlie Hebdo, fuck you and your battle views. Fuck around with press and end up them more than a bad review. Mm. So crafty, oh, nice. I've been feeling down this past week because I imagine me being you and you looking past me. Oh, shit. Crafty, you can't drink in here. You must be pissed. The shop don't serve ginger beer. <laughs> <laughs> Go abroad and look fresh. My skin tans up. You go abroad and look dead. That skin cancer. <laughs> See, Crafty's crafty. Always under that mistletoe, but crafty, crafty, so you know he's got a dick to mold. Mm. Yeah, you don't want it tonight. Check the old footage. My boys give out fly kicks like we're sponsored by Nike. Mm. There's no competing when you've lost. This dickhead's beaten off the top. Cause he's rapping with his hands a lot and speaks a load of toss. Mm. I could box him in my sleep. He'll get dosed in just one hit. Ain't got pockets for my jeans. I've got holsters for my fists. Oh. See these new school fools? Yeah. 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 See these new school fools? Just a bunch of dumb actors. I take the old school route and hit you with a bus hammer. Mm. Yeah, I'm from an era where you get beat with bars. Beef we start now. You're a league below, so bleach your soul and eat your heart out. You got a girlfriend who wants to eat my ass out. <laughs> I met his chick on Instagram. She was easy to move to. Slid into her DMs like I was putting on new boots. Nah, I'm kidding. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. I wouldn't even walk or sit beside her. Plus, I haven't felt your girl since you got divorced from Billy Piper. <laughs> yeah, I'm ignorant. So he's getting skinned alive with ginger lines. Ginger spice. He's the activist for ginger rights and he's headlining the poetry tent at Ginger Pride. <laughs> How, how's your accent go from public schoolboy to Asbo and the stat quo is that's dope? You from Peckham or Padstow? Mm. I still think he's a toy and I'ma take everything he has, bro. Fuck. Mm. Yeah. You're in a rap duo called Camouflage Children. Yep. Yes, I'm right. Dropping hot flows in random parks and buildings, typically spitting these average bars till he goes back to the day job when the cameras aren't filming. So you was a shit rapper. <laughs> you were a shit rapper. So I started bringing lenses to the booth, but awkward thing is, mate, lens is better than you. Having that dude at side got them views and nice, but you're relying on contacts. Without lens, you'd be losing sight. That means you're just mm. a side dish. I got a full course prepped. You got a jury out today. You can't full court press. I got all bases covered like a full court press, but his name with lens is a game of tennis. You need a doubles partner to get your lines fully court pressed because those mm. tracks would be shit if he didn't have lens. Even when the production's good, still he is trash then. And when they spree on rap sets, he's the bad egg, so it's like Mario Balotelli. Even when the team's performing, you still see a bad press, because <laughs> 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 Your tracks alternate between depression to arrogance, from thoughts and dreams to attacking people, getting women and balling, please. I wasn't certain of the name. When I heard your tracks, it became sure to me, camouflage for insecurity and children for immaturity. Because you're talking weed and how you're balling rich about leaving organs split and causing the wrist fist to rest. You're just talking shit, because you can act though, but the fans don't want to hear those bars. So when this man flows, it's fangled, the earlobes parts. He acts robe when he's at home, we see the tears flow hard after I cut through his defense like a pillow pass. But you know how I know they're not generic. And that they're deeper than us all. Yeah. They make videos about weed and how they ball. The graffiti down the walls. <laughs> <laughs> and one of the graffiti paintings was Mickey Mouse hanging and swinging. If you got such amateur spitting, you're too shit for don't flop and soon you'll probably be getting left hanging by Mickey. Cause then in your solo video you showed you can't. Oh. Oh. 
Then in your solo video you showed you can't rap lyrically and appropriately name the song Car Crash Symphony. Bro, with names like those, <laughs> yeah. with names like those, you can't have dignity because camouflage children, I think infant trees of infancy and harsh captivity. You just mm. talk spliffs and bullshit and don't bar that vividly. Basic punchlines and puns I don't class as imagery. You're part of that industry, that's why I can't have sympathy when I break your story down into parts. That's a trilogy because you did start ambitiously. You did start ambitiously. Then your path tracked fiscally. That's a fast activity. I'll tear apart that instantly. You battled in the underground. You're in a jungle now. You're a tiny plant. That little seed. You're like Nigel Farage. You can try, but you can't branch that bigger tree. Final round. Well, that was like 90, right? What was it meant to be? What time? Right. You went for as long. Let's go. He's talking about camouflage children. You should have come with some different lines. Cause I'm 28 now and you're still attracted to the kid inside. <laughs> <laughs> Your birthday's 9-11, yeah? Bra, the day you was born is tainted. Confused, like, is that a misfortune or a cause for celebration? Oh. Could we celebrate them towers collapsing like I know the Taliban and now you share the date like you breaking fast on Ramadan? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. So fuck it. Every single bar you spit, I have to laugh at it. Look at your face and use it as a target, bitch. Look. Fuck it, my bars, I don't forget them. You are not my brethren. I hit you in the face and you won't be collecting. Yeah, bars for days, I target flames at your heart and frame. You better start to play, pray. You got a heart that's made from nothing. You leave you shard and flayed. Fuck it. And he's from Wimbledon, yeah? Looking like his balls have just been found. He's done okay in his two first matches. Then he fucked it now. Cause he dreads his next opponent like Dustin Brown. Mm. One poem away from smoking Dustin Brown. <laughs> yeah, and you haven't got it proper yet, so please just have some honor when your skin shade is panna cotta. <laughs> <laughs> And your Harry Baker's and your Harry Baker's salad tosser. <laughs> what a tosser! How do you expect to be the winner when what's out now don't even ever get considered? You won't ever be a blizzard when your SoundCloud barely gets a listen. Oh. And I heard your music. You need to chill, relax, and get a loyal lady. Cause when your most played songs are diss track to the royal baby, <laughs> makes me wonder who would make a diss track to the royal baby. Yeah. Are you crazy? <laughs> I don't know if I'm battling Scolzi or Scratchy from Roll. Deep. <laughs> <laughs> you don't actually flow deep and your rapping is so weak. So fuck it, it's like what? I sit there, collect my clock, tell her you can put a cat in a kennel, it still don't make it a dog. What? Yeah. Let's go! Woo! Nice. Yeah. Final round, party, let's go, in one video, you said, <laughs> lick my toes, taste defeat. But there's loads to quote. Because then you said, I'll defeat you if we're going toe to toe. Mm. <laughs> Against Verb T, you said, make your face meet the floor like you got beef with the pavement. Mm. Your schemes are amazing. <laughs> with those ridiculous force bars, I don't consider you four star because I've heard of defeat before. You did a, the floor bar. <laughs> Bruv, you love defeat bars. I heard that's why you prefer doing feature tracks for Len so you can be defeat. And at work, you like serving egg and chicken to definition so you can see deaf feet, but you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't soar and hit the jackpot. So catch him on the corner trying to jackpot. He used to battle regularly, got bored of it and slacked off. Saturday nights now, catch him watching porn up on his laptop and ordering a lamb chop. Because, bruv, you look like you were fucking born in a kebab shop. <laughs> Your rap name used to be Pinky X. Yep. Pinky X. Woo. Sounds like a web page on the internet dedicated to finger sex. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm, about to, I'm about to hit DEFCON. This is devastation. When I shift press one, there'll be exclamations. You put across this image of purity like you're doing it right. But I see your insecurity when you spew in the mic. I'll expose them today and put you in the light. Because when you clash deep press, it will ruin your life. But see, I'm hardly acting stressed. Because all the bars he has are wet. So when I par, I'll have his chest and a heart attack and sent into cardiac arrest. We're not the same level. Neither hunger and ambition. We're not the same level, neither tear nor respect out me and you. I'm clearly the best, he's got no direction to thrive. It's like his steering's a mess. You can't take lessons in drive, so I don't fear he's a test, but... Mm. You're so it's old, cold. you're so old. You're getting all kinds of body syndromes. Your bars are crap. You should be on King of the Ronalds with those. Your music's ancient, <laughs> like Apollo string bowls and 18 strands. He's still following those, and if he thinks that's offensive, this will bother him loads. He called himself Press One, because when you press one on his phone, a bomb will explode, but nah. That was it. That was it, it was a joke. Terrorist To gain some leverage. I know you ain't a terrorist, but he does have it all. 
the nice clothes, the game women, but we know that your whole life shows a fake image. That's why both you and I know you ain't winning because I could beat you with my eyes closed. Like Jay Dillon. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I'm slim, I don't, I'm slim, I don't need to do press up sets to leave press up set. <laughs> but yo, you got the most nasally voice in rap. You sound like a prick. Sounds like you ain't cleared it out since 2006. <laughs> so to summarise, you're an online absurdity. Long resigned, Turkish creep, one-lining Persian weave on the wrong side of 30. He's a beggar going broke, forever smoking dope, obsessed with toe-to-toe -to -toe lines and you've never blown your nose. Time. Let's go. I don't feel justified in judging, but uh, it's crafty. Definitely. Yeah. So. Judging, crafty, and press one, I give it to uh, crafty 2 1. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, I find that really close, but I think crafty to get just like 2 1, but they're both really good, so that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I'm gonna, I, I'm giving this, I'm edging this to uh, Danny Pandolfi. Like, I mean, it was very close. Like, the second round, I think that um, press one really, like, I really expected him to win after that. It was just the, the kind of stumbles in the third. The free Stunning was good, but it just wasn't uh, quite enough for the third to bring it up on that. Uh, the first round was pretty even, but so I'm going to edge it to, to to the panda, even though he does all this. When I do this to the bear, when I could have been a fur, when I'm good in the mood. Fucking hell, guys. The old C major judging. Um, press one versus Crafty. Yeah, um, Matt closed the first two rounds. I think the first to Crafty, second to Press one, and the third to Crafty. Crafty. Yo, we're back here, it's Rapping It Party 2015. We got the first main channel done for a battle of the day. We have my man Press One coming back against our newcomer Craft D. It was a fucking dope battle. Make some noise for MCs. Let's go. Yeah. Right. Make sure you leave a comment on Viewpoint, leave a comment on the video, but picking up a win is my man Craft D. Make some noise. Yeah. That's why you can't test me at all. And don't bring your girl to an MC battle. Cause she is a slut having sex for weeks. And you're sad you're the one with the STD. We all knew she was dirty. Your ass should have slowed down. Now you're itchy and scratchy. Like Bart's favorite program. Mm. <laughs> and I bet he stamps on the ground to scare pigeons away. Like, I'm a bad man. Look, they're giving me space. <laughs>